wondering why are there not already a hundred forks of Ethereum? Like, and I don't even it's mean extremely like hard to do. forks with features like Pulse is going to have. Why are there are there are many forks of Ethereum that yeah. start empty? Many, many, yeah. many, many. I'm just wondering why there's not more because they could all make the same. If it's they could all make the same analogy. There's like, a lot. Oh, we're just going to offload the capacity. Yeah. Well, the difference is, well, I'll, I'll answer that question for you very specifically. When you make a fork of Ethereum, let's say, let's say, uh, that's a good example. You make a fork of Ethereum. Do you have users? No, nope. only if they know your fork exists. Okay. Well, how are they going to know your fork exists? You have to tell them. All right. And what are the useful things on your chain? Well, people have to launch their coins from scratch on your chain because your chain launched empty. So Polygon, BSC, AVAX, uh, Phantom, uh, they all launch empty. And because they launch empty, that means you have to go attract projects to launch their coin on your code base. And so you're starting from scratch. Pulse chain is not starting from scratch. Pulse chain has everyone's projects already there. Now, if it's fake DeFi and has oracles or other crap that's off chain, you know, that stuff doesn't come over. Or like USDT, USDT. Can you redeem them for a dollar? No, of course not. <laughs> so like the, the difference with Pulse chain is it's launching with tens of thousands of coins at launch and tens of thousands of coins trading at launch. And with all those other forks of Ethereum, they all start empty. There's a big difference. You're doing the world's largest airdrop versus no airdrop. This huge, 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 huge difference. And that's the reason why it's harder. What we're doing has never been done before, and it yep. is hard to do. So launching empty forks of Ethereum, way easy to do. Launching stateful forks, hard to do.